single column manometer which is more accurate the only difference is the cross section area as because there are two cross section areas for small change in larger area there is a huge change in the small pipe which gives us accurate reading initially the heavy liquid will be in the same level let's consider the datum the xx level and after pressure is applied it goes up to to the final datum moving del h measure the distance from center of the pipe let it be h1 for yellow liquid and h2 for heavy liquid for left hand side only one liquid that is row 1 g h1 initial plus del h plus pipe pressure on the right side we have only one liquid row 2 g h h2 plus del h also note that there is one more equation which is equation of cross section del h into larger area is equal to small area into h2 this will help solve the equation and the inclined single column manometer is even more accurate because for the same distance h2 the heavy liquid have to move a larger distance l that is more accurate reading the only difference comes is h2 is equal to l sin theta just put this in the first equation and you are good to go